It's another one champion sound, yeah. Still, we bout to get down. Who the hottest in the world right now? Just touched down in London. Bet they'll give me a pound. Tell them put the money in my hand right now. Tell the promoter we need more seats. We just sold out all the floor seats. Take me on a trip, I'd love to go someday. Take me to New York, I'd love to see us. The bomb. This way is so awesome. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be fabulous at work tomorrow. Okay. Hey, fam, what's up? This is your girl Miko, and I am back with another wig review. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, please make sure you subscribe so you can join the Fit and Fabulous crew and you don't miss out on any of my hair reviews, my wig reviews, and most importantly, my workouts. Head to the playlist, go do one of my workouts. You can make sure you get fit and fabulous right along with the crew. And today I'm going to review this beauty right here. This is the Free Trust Equal Freedom Part Lace Front Wig. And I saw her in the beauty supply store and I totally fell in love with the texture and the color. So there are two combs in the front and one comb in the back as well as your adjustable strap. And you have a lace part as well as lace all along the front of the unit. What I love about this unit is that there is not any lace along the ear tabs, which is perfect because you can shift this unit from side to side to get your three-way parting. So, so let's put her on and see what she looks like live and in the flesh. And you wanna make sure you position your unit just right. I like to put mine right behind my hairline. That seems to give me the most natural look. And as I'm brushing through, you see there are no tangles with this unit. So yeah, Miss Freedom Part is acting right. She's acting just like I like her to be. So this is what she looks like with the lace cut off. And I'm just gonna tell you guys, I love everything about this unit. Um, I love the coloring. I think they did a great job of mixing the amount of the dark root with the um, lighter ombre towards the end. The 30 color is simply gorgeous. I love the density on this unit. This unit is perfect for an everyday work wig. Um, you can wear it to go out, so you can easily take this from day to night. I like the layers. So there's layers in the front and it gets longer in the back. And you can see this unit is really light and airy and has a lot of movement to it. I love that this unit lays so flat on my head and I haven't put any water or anything on the unit. I literally just took it out of the pack and put it on to film it for you guys for this video. So it lays super duper flat. Um, I like the, the parting. The parting is a natural length and it also looks pretty natural to me. Now I did not tweeze the part or plug the part or anything like that. Unless you are right up on my head and in my face and all in my business, you can't even tell, you can't even see um, the lace in this part. So this is a unit literally that you can just put on and go. Now when I wear this to work, I am going to tack down the center with some got to be glue. That's what I do with all of my units. I will not fuss with gluing down anything else. There's really just no need for it. So this unit you can wear on either side simply by shifting the unit from one side to the other. And I think she looks really cute in either a center part or a side part. So one thing I love about this unit is that it is not tangling at all. With all the manipulation that I'm doing, running my fingers through the hair, there's absolutely no tangling. And uh, to compare this to the Janet Collection uh, Elsa wig that I did the review on, that was the first straight unit I ever did a review on here on my channel. And um, that one, it was gorgeous, but it was more of a yakky texture. I do love my yakky textures, but um, in the straight hair, all that tangling, I can do without. So this one, I like. This one actually looks like um, I had hair like maybe Michael Michelle, and I kind of straightened it and um, just kind of flat ironed it. Um, so this still, even though there is a higher luster on this hair than a yakky hair, uh, a yakky texture, it's not a high shine on the hair. So I think it still uh, looks super duper natural. So the amount of luster and shine on the hair is perfect for this particular texture. So guys, that will do it for today's review. If you are not already a part of the family, hit that subscribe button and join the crew. Also, make sure you like, comment, and share this video. Until the next time, stay beautiful, stay blessed, and make sure you get fit and family.